Why do some people consistently achieve their goals while others fail? What's their secret? Well, here's the deal. It's not about having a magic wand or being born under a lucky star. It's about the power of goals. Setting clear, actionable goals is like drawing a map for your journey. It's your compass, your north star. Without goals, you're like a ship without a rudder, tossed about by the waves of life. But with clear goals, you can steer your life in the direction you want. You see, achieving goals isn't about luck or talent. It's about setting the right goals and following through. It's about commitment, consistency, and the courage to step out of your comfort zone. It's about knowing where you're going, why you're going there, and what you need to do to get there. If you're ready to start achieving your goals, then you're in the right place. The first step to achieving your goals is setting them. But what makes a good goal? Well, let's dive into the basics. It's not enough to vaguely say, I want to be successful, or I want to get fit. These goals, while admirable, lack the necessary structure to guide you to success. That's where the SMART goal framework comes in. SMART is an acronym that stands for Specific, Measurable, Achievable, Relevant, and Time-Bound. Let's break down these components. Firstly, specific. A good goal must be clear and well-defined. Rather than saying you want to be successful, specify what success looks like to you. It could be getting a promotion, starting a business, or writing a book. The more specific you are, the clearer your path to success becomes. Next, measurable. A goal without a measurable outcome is like a sports competition without a scoreboard. How will you track your progress? How will you know when you've achieved your goal? Whether it's losing 20 pounds, saving $5,000, or reading 50 books, having a measurable goal keeps you motivated and lets you know when to celebrate your success. Then comes achievable. It's crucial that your goal is realistic and attainable. While it's good to dream big, setting impossible goals can lead to disappointment. Make sure your goal challenges you, but is still within reach. Relevant is the fourth component. Your goal must align with your overall life plan and values. If your aim is to live a peaceful life in the countryside, becoming a high-powered city lawyer might not fit. Ensure your goal is relevant to the life you want to lead. Lastly, time-bound. Every goal needs a target date, a point in time when you aim to achieve it. This creates a sense of urgency and gives you a deadline to work towards. To sum up, a goal to lose 20 pounds in 4 months by following a specific diet and exercise plan is a SMART goal. It is specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. Remember a SMART goal is a goal you're more likely to achieve. Now that you have a SMART goal, how do you plan to achieve it? The road to success is paved with detailed plans. You see, a plan is your roadmap. It guides you from where you are to where you want to be. It breaks down the journey into smaller, manageable steps, making the destination less daunting and more achievable. Imagine your goal is a mountain peak. It's high, it's far, it's intimidating. But if you have a detailed plan, it's like having a trail up the mountain. Each step on this trail is a smaller task that leads you closer to the peak. Suddenly, the mountain doesn't seem that high or far anymore. Now let's talk about these smaller tasks. What are they exactly? They are sub-goals, bite-sized pieces of your main goal. Each one is a task that can be completed in a reasonable amount of time. For instance, if your goal is to write a book, a smaller task could be to write a chapter or even a page a day. These smaller tasks are crucial, they make the seemingly impossible possible. They turn the abstract into the tangible, they transform the overwhelming into the manageable. They are the magic that turns dreams into reality. But creating smaller tasks is not enough. You also need to set deadlines for each task. Deadlines create a sense of urgency. They push you to act. They prevent procrastination. They keep you on track. They are the heartbeat of your plan. Remember, each deadline brings you a step closer to your goal. So don't fear deadlines, embrace them. Think of each one as a stepping stone on your path to success. Each stone is a task completed, a milestone reached, a victory celebrated. In conclusion, if you want to achieve your goals, you need a plan. A plan that breaks down your goal into smaller, manageable tasks. A plan that sets deadlines for each task. A plan that guides you, motivates you, and pushes you to succeed. Remember, a goal without a plan is just a wish. So, start planning. How do you stay focused and productive while working towards your goals? It's a question we often ask ourselves, isn't it? Staying productive is not just about ticking off tasks from a to-do list. It's about working smarter, not harder. And the first step towards enhancing productivity is to eliminate distractions. In this digital age, distractions are just a click away. So it's important to create a workspace that is free from unnecessary interruptions. 
Whether it's turning off your social media notifications during work hours or investing in noise-canceling headphones, find what works for you and stick to it. Next, set specific times for working on your goals. This could be an hour in the morning before everyone else wakes up or late at night when the world is quiet. The key is consistency. When you dedicate a specific time each day towards your goals, it becomes a habit, and habits are powerful tools that can drive you towards success. One of the most overlooked aspects of staying productive is taking regular breaks. It's easy to get caught in the hustle and forget to pause, but remember, your brain needs downtime to recharge and replenish. So make it a point to take short breaks every hour or so. Stand up, stretch, or simply close your eyes and breathe. These tiny moments of relaxation can actually boost your productivity in the long run. And lastly, maintain a positive mindset. Challenges and setbacks are part of the journey towards achieving your goals. Instead of letting them pull you down, use them as stepping stones. Believe in your capabilities and remind yourself that every effort you put in today is a step closer to your goal tomorrow. Remember, productivity isn't about being busy, it's about being effective. So, work smart, stay consistent, take breaks, and keep a positive mindset. These are the keys to staying productive while working towards your goals. Because at the end of the day, it's not about how much you do, but how well you do it. What do you do when you hit a roadblock? Obstacles, those unexpected detours and speed bumps that pop up along our journey, can be frustrating. But it's important to remember that they are not the end of the road. In fact, they are often the stepping stones to success. They test our resilience, our determination, and our ability to think outside the box. When faced with an obstacle, the first strategy is to seek help. There's a common misconception that asking for help is a sign of weakness, but in reality, it's a sign of strength. It shows that you're committed to your goals and that you're willing to do whatever it takes to achieve them. So don't be afraid to reach out to mentors, colleagues, or even professional advisors. Their insights and experiences can provide you with a fresh perspective and potentially innovative solutions. Learning from mistakes is another powerful strategy. Every obstacle presents an opportunity for learning. When things don't go as planned, don't dwell on the failure. Instead, focus on the lessons learned. What can you do differently next time? How can you improve? Remember, mistakes aren't failures, they're simply feedback. Lastly, stay resilient. Resilience is the ability to bounce back from setbacks to keep going when things get tough. It's about maintaining a positive attitude and a strong belief in your abilities, even in the face of adversity. It's about understanding that every challenge is a chance to grow, to evolve, to become better. So when you hit a roadblock, don't view it as a dead end. Instead, see it as an opportunity to learn, to grow, to innovate. Leverage the power of help, learn from your mistakes, stay resilient and keep your eyes on the prize. Remember it's not about how many times you fall but how many times you get back up. Obstacles don't block the path, they are the path, and it's this path, filled with ups and downs, trials and triumphs, that leads to success. Let's quickly recap what we've learned today. We've delved into the power of setting SMART goals. Specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. These are not just buzzwords but a blueprint for success. We've understood that without clear and tangible goals, we're simply drifting. Next, we unraveled the art of planning. A well-laid plan is like a roadmap guiding us towards our destination. It breaks down our goals into manageable tasks, making them less daunting. We also touched upon the importance of staying productive. We learned that productivity isn't about being busy, but about effective time management and prioritizing tasks that move us closer to our goals. Finally, we discussed overcoming obstacles. Challenges are inevitable but they're also opportunities for growth. The key is to remain resilient, adapt, and keep moving forward. Remember, the journey to achieving your goals starts with a single step. So what you waiting for? Don't forget to subscribe for more interesting facts and insights. What are you waiting for?